Zillion, not Zillion. Jesus, <laughs> Louisa. <laughs> oh <that's> man, <laughs> that is not at all Zillion. No, that's balance. I know, I know who that is. I just saw the hair for a minute, and I was like, oh. That you really did look at one thing. Well, let's see if he that's is balance. drawn to this game like a moth up against the lamp. The Zelda main. Wow, what a tag! That's yeah. amazing. Well, Alright, so Balance starting with Banjo and Kazooie. Banjo Kazooie is actually a character that Balance has been playing. I don't know how seriously, but hmm. I've seen I've seen this character come out multiple times. Oh my wow. god, that's hilarious. Well, if there's one way to counter that move, I suppose that's one of them. Yeah, sure, surefire way. Yeah, hmm. down throw into the fair because a lot of people are mashing out. And even if you do, I mean, sometimes that fair really just catches you, especially hmm. like at these percents. You're most likely going to hit that, but right now we got to see him react to this a little bit more because Lamp is really holding forward with these ups and bees. Mm -hmm. yeah, a lot of the up and bees going straight onto the stage, which is really punishable. Normally it's a pretty good mix-up. Down tilt is so good at two-framing. Wow, barely doesn't have the distance either. Mm -hmm. It's not that down tilt. Like you said, great at two-framing and actually has a pretty nasty angle. So I love the way the balance dealt with that invincibility as well. Immediately going high, using the spring to cover things and mm -hmm. pulling out the eggs. That's not something you're going to do all the time as a Banjo, but it's good to keep it in mind. Shield poking, though, after the down air. Mm -hmm. and really big for balance there, actually, because he gets rid of the Phantom, too. Yeah, that could have been a big setup for Lamp. Mm -hmm. And again, using the egg to get rid of the Phantom. Ooh, the setup! Great use of Nairs, though. Match that combo break. Get out all the suspect stuff. Oh, Ooh, yeah, drop that shield a little bit early. Now with that last Wonder Wing gone, though, you're free to pressure off stage a little bit more. We'll see if Lamp is... It's going to stick to the ledge traps, though, as most Zeldas often do, and it's going to be that three-quarters phantom to take it out. You know, just use a, use that quicker sword swing. Down throw, do we have the DI? We don't, but Ooh. lamp buffer and the jab. Yeah, I think that was supposed to be uh, a, a hop nair. nair yeah. yeah. But missing the jump input. Now, the Pharaoh's win to get away, but because lamp did not land on the platform, she got punished by balance landing there, and now that lag comes in to help her. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, great job mixing up the distance, but catching literally anything out of that scenario other than a shield. Mm -hmm. And Balance has been picking up. I mean, mostly it's been jumps out of the Pharaoh's Wind after that. Now he's, boy, I mean, if you've ever seen a tank, there's there's one to do it. Balance's use of Wondering is really interesting. It's definitely not the way that I traditionally see mm -mm. Banjo and Kazoo players use it. Which, which most people would say it's not proper, but if it's working, then it's proper yeah. enough. Hey, Ooh. not getting a lot of... We saw that exact situation the last time Lamp went for that down smash at ledge. So I think maybe, you know, just playing a little bit more reactively at ledge, this time getting through the egg and setting up. Oh, and again, we're seeing that Thor's wind not quite working out. No mm. more Wonder Wings on this stock. Going to be a back throw? No, no down throw. it's going to be a down throw. Drag Where? down, do it again. Oh, yeah. into the up tilt, catches the mash, and that's Balance taking the first game. You gotta, you gotta be aware that that up tilt will eventually come out to kill you out of the down throw. You know, even if your match mash is amazing, you still gotta worry about it at the high percents. Actually, that's the only time you have to worry about it because it does not pull you out of berry. Oh. So that's that's part of the mix up. Is I you see. Uh, you just don't mash and then you get beat and then you beat the um, up tilt option. That's interesting. Yeah. But well, good to know. Now. As we get the stage to Smashville, I'm wondering, no character counterpick. Now, normally Zeldas like to play with a lot of distance, but I think I like this for this matchup, at least, where you don't force Banjo to land on that center platform, mm -hmm. but you at least take away a lot of options for him when he's landing. Yeah. You can get a lot more coverage with Zelda here, at least. You definitely do. Wow, we're seeing a lot of that, a lot of those eggs flying. I actually see uh, Trella. Uh, in particular, use a lot of those eggs to actually make confirms out of them. There we go. Already two Wonder Wings gone. We see Balance really trigger happy with them early and late in the stocks. We see get real close up with that grab too. Oh Ooh. my gosh, the setup of the Phantom in that situation? Are you that, me? That's what I'm talking about. Is you know, as long as you get those setups out and then play reactively afterwards, you can't get caught in a feedback loop when you're playing a character like Zelda, where you have all these projectiles to rely on. Wow, Ooh, the reverse well, hit the other way. I was not expecting that. I don't think balance was either, but somehow surviving. Mm -mm. Oh, trying to trying to use the nearest to reflect the egg bomb, but unfortunately, mm -hmm. it moves very slow. Ooh, now catch that landing with the neighbor's love. I forgot what that move was called. Let's down be and up smash. So that's the mix-up that you're talking about. Is that once that down throw comes out at higher percents, if you mash out and they read that, they can get the up tilt, but otherwise they can just go for the up smash out of it. 
Okay. Ooh, really scary recovery from balance. I love the Nera's there. Uh, a great adaptation to what balance has been doing at the ledge where he just drops the egg and comes back up with the back air. Mm -hmm. A usage of the Din's fire to try to get back. Balance misses the two frame. Now we got to see if he can lock down the Zelda at ledge once again. He's been doing a pretty good job of it so far, but he tends to overextend at least a little bit once she does get back on stage. We'll see, though, how he plays it off stage. Maybe he goes for a full edge guard this time. Whew. Yeah, once you start charging that forward smash, you're vulnerable to those projectiles. All right, now again we're seeing the nears. Mm. So the Din's fire coming out to edge guard and then eventually catching an air dodge up onto the stage. Forward smash takes it. Oof. Really not letting Balance get close with any of these projectiles, using a lot of that Nehru's love now. Back though to get her off, as you'd expect to see. Ooh, and again, we're seeing Teleport on stage. I don't know if that was intentional. Oof. Up tilt. It's not going to kill, but Balance goes off stage for that edge guard, which I think that, especially with a stock lead, you're definitely allowed to do that Ooh. as Banjo. And she'll grab out of the eggs. There we go, and forward air this time, we're super ready for it. Mm -hmm. Fair is actually super fast. It's a very quick option out of shield. It's just not always the best one because you're not always going to get that sweet spot, and it's super neg on hit a lot of the time. Sweet spot's what you want. Yeah. Ooh, okay. trying to catch balance rolling. Not going to find it now. A jab reset for balance, but it's just going to finish up that gentleman. Keep it going. Mm. I think that balance may have wanted the Wonder Wing to try to edge guard. Oh. You can just hold it at the ledge. Now he might be looking to do just that. I'm trying to catch that two frame doesn't quite. And now Ooh. we're seeing those eggs. He gets into mm -hmm. the up tilt. That got, was cute. You got to remember, those eggs are going to lead into a lot of combos for Banjo out of the held version now. Down. Get the down throw into up smash most likely. Forward. No, forward. The Breagle bash to finish it off. That'll be a 2-0 for Balance's Banjo and Kazooie. And I didn't know that that caught mash out. I guess that catches mash out if they're not, uh, if they're mashing a little bit slow and they don't buffer stuff. Maybe? Like, I feel like jump might, might get out of that, but that, that hits so high. Yeah. I don't know. It does. And uh, again, you've also always got to be aware of the up smash as well. Yeah. I don't know. I Banjo and Kazooie's down throw is always really weird for me because, like, every time I played against Banjo and Kazooie, I, I just, like, teleport out of it. Yeah. So I don't actually know. Like, every time they go for stuff. Clearly, you just have an amazing mash. I don't 